Well, good afternoon. This is Plant Smart Living with Farmer Fred. It's a beautiful day here in early October. It's nice and flannel shirt weather. We can start putting them on. Earlier we did a video at the Forgotten Pumpkin Patch on harvesting your squash and did another video on, on washing your squash and then also one on curing your squash. And so today's focus is going to be on where to store our squash. And so we'll see you in a little while. So we're in my garage where we store the winter squash, the acorn squash, and the butternut squash. I really like these containers. These are stackable storage bins. You know, this is these are from Mainstay from Walmart. You can see they have slotted sides on them and a cutout front, and so you can easily access them. They actually have a little tilt to them. And we'll provide a link to a similar storage bin. These are also great for like potatoes and onions. I would highly recommend that for storage. Uh, and this, this is next to our, our door here for our kitchen, so it's easy to access these bins. Uh, these are actually some homemade storage shelves I made out of 2x4s and some half-inch plywood. But uh, that's a great place. We're, we're putting our acorn squash here and our butternut squash. I have a, a bunch more here. Uh, and I'm actually going to be storing some of these in our basement, too, because we have quite a bit here. Uh, this, the basement is another place for, great place for storage around 50 55 degree temperature uh, and uh, it's a nice humid place down there for your squash so that's another great place you can also store them and again even using the same container so so that they allow the the uh, squash to breathe and so I hope this information has been helpful for you uh, if you have any questions or comment please leave them in the space below and so I just hope you have a wonderful day until next time this is plant smart living with farmer Fred.